In this video, I'm going to show you how to do partial products for digit by one digit multiplication. And this is the fast version for those of you who just want a refresher. You remember uh, what it all means, but this is just a reminder of how to do it quickly. And if you want a more detailed step-by-step -step explaining what everything means, uh, check out one of my other videos. So let's start here. The 5,426 expanded out means 5,000 plus 400 plus 20 plus 6. Let's start on the right with our 3 times 6, and 3 times 6 is 18. And I'm just going to write that out without carrying anything, and now my 6 is done. Now we're going to move over to my 2 which really means 20, that's the key thing, and 20 times 3 is 60. So I write that whole thing out, and now my 2 is done. And now I'm going to move over to my 4, which means 400, and 400 times 3 is 12 hundreds, or 1,200, and my 4 is done. And now we're going to move over to my fives, and that five means 5,000, and 5,000 times three is 15,000. So five times three is 15, and then I need my three zeros to represent the entire thing. Okay, so now I've got all my parts multiplied out, and then all I need to do is add up all the parts, being careful that I lined up all my ones, all my tens, my hundreds, my thousands, and my ten thousands. Eight plus zeros is eight. And one plus six is seven. Two plus zero is two. One plus five is six. And then I just go ahead and pull down my one. I always put my comma in after my ones, tens, hundreds, so it goes right there, and there's my answer. 5,426 times 3 is 16,278. Thanks for joining me.